Powerhouse, presented by Alliant Energy. You don't generally see it, but the right amount of insulation is the key to keeping the air inside your home comfortable and energy efficient, no matter what the weather is outside. Not having enough insulation in your home is a leading cause of energy waste in most homes. Insulation helps maintain a uniform temperature throughout the house and makes walls, ceilings, and floors warmer in the winter and cooler in the summer. Insulation is rated on an R value, which tells you how resistant it is to heat flow. The higher the number, the better it insulates. The R value depends on the type of material, the thickness and density, so read the package carefully to make sure you are getting the correct amount. Adding insulation to your attic is fairly easy and is very cost effective since it's more accessible. Most homes should be between R30 and R60 insulation in the attic. To find out if you have enough insulation in your attic, measure the thickness. If it's less than 11 inches of fiberglass or 8 inches of cellulose, you could probably use more. Besides the attic, other areas of the home that need insulation are sidewalls. It's recommended sidewalls should have an R value around 19. Floors and crawl spaces should have an R value between 19 and 25, and basements should have an R value of 10. You may be wondering what type of insulation is the best to use. Well, there are several types out there, from the traditional fiberglass to blown-in cellulose, and it really depends how much is needed, how accessible the location is, and how big the space is that needs to be insulated. For the most part, blown-in cellulose and fiberglass baths are both good choices. If you need to put in extra insulation, you can put certain types over existing insulation. For example, you can put bats down over blown in insulation, but do not use bats with a foil, paper, or plastic facing on them. Also, you want to avoid compressing the insulation. If you put something heavier over what is already there, the insulation will not give you its full rated R value. If you have an existing home with little or no insulation in the sidewalls, you can still add insulation. The most common type is blown-in insulation. Sidewall insulation is usually installed from the outside, but it can be done from the inside by drilling holes into plaster or drywall. Another important thing to remember is that openings like lights, vents, and chimneys need to be sealed to help maximize the effectiveness of the insulation. Also keep in mind that areas like crawl spaces or rooms over garages should be insulated as well. Most people think of adding insulation right before the cold weather sets in. The right amount of insulation is also important for summer months. So if you need extra insulation, don't put it off. Start saving money and energy right now. If you decide to install insulation by yourself, be sure to wear the proper clothing, including gloves, respirators, and eye protection. You can check the efficiency of your home by participating in one of two energy audits from Alliant Energy. With My Home Comfort Checkup, you can analyze your home energy use. It's a free service and will pinpoint energy wasters in your home. After you complete a brief survey, you'll receive an assessment of your home's energy use and recommendations. If you get your heating energy from Alliant Energy, you might be eligible for a professional in-home audit. If your home qualifies, Alliant Energy will send a certified energy expert to inspect your home. The auditor will identify ways for you to reduce your energy usage, give you estimates on how much the upgrades will cost, and tell you how much you can expect to save. Just call 1-866-ALLIANT for more information. You can then receive rewards for implementing the recommended energy improvements to your home. If your home has enough insulation or you aren't ready to make the investment, there are some low-cost things you can do like weather stripping doors and windows, caulk around windows, install a door sweep, and wrapping pipes to insulate them. If you've had an in-home audit, you can receive rewards from Alliant Energy for doing these low-cost projects. When we come back, find out the most energy-efficient way to light your home.